Step up! Hello, we are Stray Kids! Woo! Wow! Right now, we we're just with Zach Zhang. Yeah, we had such a great time. It was so amazing, and we talked about a lot of stuff. So please, check it out! Check it out! Check it out. Zach Zhang Show. Let's do this! Hello, beautiful human. We got Sanchez here. We got Dan here, Yo. and we casually have Stray Kids in the studio. Right. What up? Woo-hoo! Stray yeah. Kids. Yeah. Woo. Stray Kids. Yeah. Wow. Hello. Hi. Are you okay with that microphone, Felix? Yeah. No, it feels good. <laughs> it feels good. Yeah, I'm comfortable. It feels uh, feel kind of trapped, but yeah, it's yeah. good. Yeah. We good. We good. Okay. Yeah. Are, is everybody like? I want to say this is the most people we've had in this studio. Really? And oh, I'm really? trying to gather everybody uh-huh. and make sure that we're all here. Hello. Oh. Uh. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Hi. All the way back there. Hi. Hello. By the way, before we start, I do got to do a commercial real quick. Uh, this conversation is brought to you by Total Wireless. They're really cool. Um, there's never been a better time to move to Total Wireless. If you want more information, link in the bio. Yeah. Okay. Stray Kids, thank you for giving us time and energy. What is it like just getting around? Because there's so many of you, oh, right. and your team is thick, dude. Thick with like four C's. <laughs> oh. It's it's like a moving family. Yeah, we, yeah. Well, we all live together as well. True. Um, yep. It's wow. uh, it's it's not so bad though, because we we yeah we have two cars, so before each for each car when we move around, so it's it's not so bad. But yeah. is it a, a lot of people to remember, a lot of personalities to keep track of? It's um, it's funny. <laughs> it seems like there's a lot of people, but right. then again, we feel so close to each other mm-hmm. that it's like. Just, just one big family. That's it. Yeah. Plus, we've known each other for <coughs> a very long time, so mm-hmm. there's nothing to worry about. Yep. Yeah. You guys live together. Yeah. 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 We live together. <laughs> oh my god, what's that like? <laughs> That's crazy. You don't want to Every know. night yeah. is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> noise. Every night, I, I don't think every night is crazy because you guys have been together for so many years that you've, like, the the glamour or the like party side of this whole thing probably has worn off. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, obviously, you guys hang out for the first time, like the first, maybe the first few months. It's like insane. I know you do the reality yeah. show. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But you probably have like a routine every day. Like, people go to the gym, you know what each other eats for breakfast. Oh, yeah. true, true, true. Yeah. From the reality show, what do you learn about each other? Um. Well, honestly, we knew each other before the whole show even started. But, um, but that must bring you closer. Yeah, it did. It yeah, did. It, it did. did. The show brought us really, really close because um, we had to face like um, challenges and missions that you know would um, maybe threaten you know if we were gonna go as you know all the members or not. But um, luckily, you know, in the end, you know, we got to be who we are right now, and we're just really, really close due to the fact that we got through the reality show. Mm-hmm. You got through the reality show, but you also got through a ton of training. Yeah. Yep. It's Your story's amazing. What does Stray Kids mean? What? Stray Kids. Stray Ooh. Kids. What is wow. the meaning? Stray Kids. It's got a lot of meanings. Um, one of our um, our biggest uh, phrases that we always talk about is Stray Kids everywhere all around the world. And it's not just saying that, you know, us Stray Kids being everywhere all around the world, but it's, it's more of, um, you know, because... For anyone, they could feel astray, right? They could feel, you know, hopeless. They could feel, you know, a bit lost. And um, I guess everyone can be a stray kid and we're just reaching out to those people with our music. And um, I think that's one of our key goals, you know, being a part of Stray Kids. For, for you two on the end, I mean, growing up in Australia. Yep. Yeah. What was it about K-pop for you guys? Like, why? why? I, and I don't mean to ask that in such like a mm-hmm. brash way, but like, could have done other stuff, right? True, true, true. true. But, you want to go first? Yeah. Oh, I mean, I guess for me, when I was little, I, I just grew up listening to music, whether it's K-pop, pop. I listened to all kinds of genre of music. And, you know, having to listen to K-pop growing up, I guess it made me think, oh, you know what? Why not just give it a shot? So if there's any chance coming by, you know, get ready for it. And yeah. Mm-hmm. But like you have a pop scene too. You could have done like a Australian Idol or something. True, oh, true, true. true. W- what but, was it about like the genre? Oh, like for me, for K-pop is especially K-pop. 
I was just very into dancing, you know, mm-hmm. how they prepare for stages. Performances. And so even performing while dancing and having to show all kinds of other stuff, that just really caught my attention mm-hmm. to what K-pop really is. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, that's why I look forward to it. Because it really is different. Like the way the, the, the way an artist's journey kind of exists and the way it evolves, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. like with the stages, with the mm-hmm. trainee program, with yep. everything, like it, yep. it's a different level of investment that people have in the music and in the artist. Yeah. Very true. Is there pressure that comes along with that? I think it's different for everyone, um, especially for me, because uh, <laughs> I've been a trainee for I think around eight years now. Eight years. Yeah, <sighs> it's, it, was, it, it took me eight years to finally debut. But um, I think for me, the biggest pressuring thing was if I could make it or not. Um, you know, if this is gonna you know, go where I want it to go. I don't know if I'm going to debut or not, you know, but I'm still here. Um, there, there probably is a reason why I'm still here. i got to keep trying. And then, yeah, results came and it was amazing. So, I, I, But like not knowing what's going to happen, I think for me was the most pressuring. Hmm. So eight years you're in this program, that's like a really hard thing to be a part of. Like it's <laughs> yeah. not easy. Is there a real fear that you might not debut? Yes, there is. Because, um, I don't know, I, it's probably different for a lot of companies, but um, uh, I guess when, from companies, uh, companies' opinion, um, if they think you don't have the potential anymore, they could just, yeah, they can just yeah. cut you out and be like, you know, we don't think you're going to get anywhere and they can say bye-bye. There was a time when, um, for, me, for me, I had a lot of... Um, you know, people that I was close to, but then oh, besides just me, everyone else just did not make it. And I was alone for quite a while. And that's when, you know, like a lot of thoughts came in and yeah, I, I was in like a very dark stage of my time and it was pretty hard, mm. but getting through all that, um, I don't know, got my mindset to get a bit more clear, clearer. Um, these boys came in and yeah, they, Basically yeah. saved me. <laughs> What's up? Yeah. What do you mean save? Yeah, you saved. You saved. <laughs> <laughs> or did you, you save each save? other? I think, wow. still, I think we saved each other. Yeah. Yeah. We were destined to be. Oh. Destiny. Wow. Destiny. Maybe, maybe this was our fate. <laughs> this was fate. Yeah. I mean, for everybody, it was because you all have your different paths into this program. True. I mean, some of you guys were recognized on the street, and somebody came up to you. Some of you like actively sought it out mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and wanted to be a part of it because you recognize something in, within yourself. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. How do you stay true to who you are while you share this identity with eight other guys? Like as a team? Yeah, I mean, because like you have to remind yourself who you are. We have artists that come in here all the time, right? Mm-hmm. Right. Who lose themselves to fame, in a sense, or this uh, character that they've created in an album. And then they have to remind themselves, you know what I mean? Like, like what their deal is, who they are again. No, no, no. There's, there's no, nothing to no. reassure with us because um, yeah. in our music, in our performances, and the, the, the people that you see in, in, in our album, photo book or whatever, that's who we are. Like, mm. everything is really genuine with us. If, if we have something on our mind, we put it in our song and we put it out there, you know, because there may be people, there may be stays out there who are thinking the exact same thing. And so for us, I, we think that's really important, especially with us making our own music as well. Um, it's because, you know, lyrics and music wise, you know, we're the ones who are thinking it. We're the ones who are making it. And because, you know, fans and stays out there, they might be feeling the same thing. So that's why it's really important for us to be genuine and be who we are as stray kids while doing our music. But, yeah. but at the same time, like, you are stray kids, but would you consider each one of you a stray kid? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, you know, if, if we didn't feel like a stray kid, um, we wouldn't be a stray kid. Like, we wouldn't be stray kids if we didn't feel... Like stray kid, if you if you know what I mean. Yeah. Like um, I think everyone has you know we we're eight, we're eight people. Everyone's different, but we all share the same dream. True, and I think that's what, the reason why we can you know you know stick closer and have the same thoughts, have the same feelings, and become you know 
uh, all we can all join up to be stray kids. Mm-hmm. Do you become a stray kid before or after training? Because you go into training wanting something and having this dream. True, 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 true. Um, but stray kids doesn't mean you officially accomplished it. Of course, of course, of, of course. course. That's that, that's also true. Um, we, uh, you know, you know how the um, the reality program started off with, um, I guess, just me, um, <clears throat> you know, recruiting everyone and you know showing what we're made of. And um, the reason why I could, you know, recruit everyone and have everyone together and, you know, you know, really show them what we're made of, it was because we had the same dream that we wanted to accomplish. And so if you put it in like a step-by-step kind of way, um, I guess the first dream was to actually debut. And um, I guess we did that as a team. And then now, after that, we have a lot of other things that we want to accomplish. Mm-hmm. Obviously, this series, mm-hmm. which is French, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Clay yeah. is French Clay. for key. Wow. So, the key series. Mm-hmm. And the last one was Levin, Levanta. Which mm-hmm. is wind. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a med- Mediterranean wind, I think, Yeah, in the Middle East. Yeah. What is, like, this thing is amazing. It's like a book. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's Pass like, it around. It's Let's the see. most high quality <laughs> thing I've ever touched. And like the photos are beautiful. Mm-hmm. I mean, there's a real art to just the display of your music, which, by the way, is a K pop thing. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And in the, the US music market has totally lost respect for the physical album. You know what I mean? Oh, I think I know what you mean. Oh. Yeah, we don't make that anymore. Nobody like nobody right. does that. <laughs> Talk to these guys in here. You right. feel the Look paper? That's this a good nice. That's a good quality paper. Yeah, it smells yeah, good. good. It's good paper. It smells great. It's <laughs> fresh and new. <laughs> oh, I Look at that. Smell. I love this. Do you oh, thank you. Thank you. Each have your own favorite part of the creative process, and like would love to go around the room. Oh yes. Uh, 우리가 이제 뭐 앨범이든 뭐 사실 뮤직비디오든 정말 많은 것들을 만들잖아요. 우리가 컴백할 때그 과정에서 이제 개인적으로 제일 좋아하는 부분이든지. 네, 일단 저는 뮤직비디오를 만들 때 제일 흥미가 가는데요. 어 되게 그 일단 처음에 뮤직비디오 시나리오를 볼 때도 그렇고 되게 멋진 이야기들을 저희가 만들어 나가는 거잖아요. 그리고 음흠. 그 과정들을 찍는 거고 음. 그리고 그 찍은 모든 결과물들을 우리 스테이랑 같이 공유를 할때 정말 되게 설레고 재밌는 일 같아요. 음. So for Han, um, you know, there's a lot of stuff that you know we do in the creative process, but um, for Han, especially when we're filming the music videos, um, it's really really fun for him because you know because we are the ones who are filming the whole story and to be a part of it it's really fun for him and you know the final result of what we actually made as well to be able to watch it not just with us but um, with our fans as well that itself is really fun for him as well Mm -hmm. music videos yeah music videos you also like cheesecake I love it. <laughs> I love that thing. Wow, bang on. Is my, bang on. I'm, I'm a cheesecake guy too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah Cheesecake Factory is amazing. Have you been? <laughs> oh, yeah. These guys have yeah, 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 actually been. been. Oh, so good. Yeah. And but the original is in town. Like the oh, first really? one ever. Wow. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah we, we went the last year. We, 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 we went the last year. Oh, LA. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that is true. We went the last time. I wish you cheesecake in your suit near your future. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, favorite part of the creative process. Let's go, keep going around oh, yeah. the room here. Uh, uh, to, to, to no. Same opinion with Han. Um, I also like when I shoot music videos. Mm-hmm. Um, I think it's quite interesting that we can uh, make the opinions for the scenes mm-hmm. and every quiet performances as well. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And I also love the Meal time for music radio. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Meal time. Oh, the food? Yeah. 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 We can charge. It's, it's really, really good. We'll, we'll invite you next time. <laughs> <laughs> the craft services attached to the music yeah. videos it's are just really fabulous. It's, it's, it's amazing. Great. Charge yeah. the energy. For On shooting. point. Yeah. Yeah. It's Five really stop. important. Yeah. <laughs> Lino, what are you thinking? Uh, I'm going 안무를 준비할 때가 아~ 가장 재밌는 것 같아요. 
Um, so for Lino, it's um, when we're learning the choreography for the new performance. Mm-hmm. Do you take lead on that? Do you teach everybody? Uh, sometimes he teaches us. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Who actually comes up with the dance moves? Um, well, in our company, we do have a special um, dance production team. So um, they would uh, work with us and we would share our opinions together. Oh, ideas. And yeah, we'd work with them while we're making the whole thing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Cool. Yeah. Let's keep going. Favorite part of the creative process. Right. I am. So for I am, it's um, when we're recording the title song. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How do we uh, figure out who's going to take which verse? Uh, especially we share our opinions with our company, JYP. Mm. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> our company yeah. does that. So yeah. we, we share the opinions with company as well. If there's lyrics that you guys wrote personally, mm-hmm. right. are you okay with having somebody else sing that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I think I think we're really okay with it. Um, sometimes, especially for you know Three Racha, when we write our song, we write the lyrics. Um, you know, sometimes we would actually think of the person um, and write it. For example, for me, um, when I was writing Gone Days, um, there was a pre-op part where it goes me to my, but then. When I was writing it, um, I really wanted um, Hyunjin to sing this part because I felt like he would make the 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 feeling. yeah he he would really um, use that feeling really well. So it's it's I think it's different for all the time. Mm-hmm. It's about the product. Yeah. It's about the song at the end of the day and yes, doing what's best true. for the song. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, cool. So true. What's your favorite part? My part. <laughs> I'd go with same with Iron. I'd go with the same with um, recording the title track as well. Mm-hmm. Because I, even like what Chan Young said, he always thinks about whose part, you know, would fit best. And, you know, sometimes Chang Bin Young would even think, oh, you know, for example, Felix would suit this, you know, deep, low voice part, Mm -hmm. you know, for example. So I take that like, oh, okay, I know what he wants. And so I listen to his recordings and then guides and then, yeah, I just go in for the recording. Nails it. And fans love it. Nails it. You do have this insanely beautiful deep voice. He does. Thank you. (laughs) It's all good now. It's all good now. <laughs> wow. <sighs> this mic really does it wonders. <laughs> Combinator sound. Bravo. I think this mic is doing all the work. <laughs> it's actually pretty cool. No. Only 50% but, yeah. of the way. Uh, by the way, Double Knot, that was a song that you guys recorded fully in English. Yep. What is that process like? How do you tackle just breaking that down? Um, we'll, we'll, we'll do it step by step. Um... First of all, we have the original song in Korean, mm-hmm. right? And then, okay, we're going we're gonna to make this in English. And so the process was, first of all, we had to change all the lyrics to he, English, right? He translated all of the things. Yes. And he changed, yeah. Um, yeah, it was quite hard because I didn't want to change the original meaning of the song. Mm. And also, especially with the rap parts, because they're so fast. I had quite a hard time trying not to break the actual, the original flow, um, trying not to break the meaning, and you know somehow I got it. Somehow I got it, and um, honestly, I was I felt a bit sorry to the people who had to record it because you know it's in a different language as well. Yet it's so fast and it's so not you know used to the the original pronunciation. But um, luckily everyone practiced really hard. Everyone nailed it. So. I'm actually really thankful for the to the members who recorded it for. Yeah, yeah. who recorded it. Yeah, <laughs> because I mean, is that the hardest recording session you guys take on? For me, uh, my part was a, a bit short sentence because mm-hmm. because I'm in charge of vocals. So true, true, true. other rappers' part was really long and fast, <laughs> and full of yeah. words. So. I think rappers had a hard time yeah, for it. It was really hard. This I mean, um, English version. Yeah, how how was that part? You know, even if you think you can't get it. Out, the the oh, it is not easy for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very difficult. Sounds yeah. so good though. Oh, oh yeah. Really? Great. yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Shout uh, out to rappers. Yeah. 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 Rap, rappers. <laughs> it is like it's a weird puzzle things. that you had to put together. True. You know? Mm-hmm. Like because it, not all of it's gonna translate literally mm-hmm. so you have to match the essence but also yeah. match the cadence of the song yeah the flow yeah that's, it's a real challenge 
but luckily Naughty. it came out really well. So he's genius. Uh, no, 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 no. But I'm kind of glad that it became like this. <laughs> yeah, but like the hardest part is on you guys for carrying it out and like it, it sounds amazing. Thank you. Why was it Thank important so to do a song in English? Because you did two in English. True, true, true. Why was that important for you guys to make two songs in English? Like well, all English. For us, we just wanted to. Well, firstly, having to you know to we wanted to make the songs in English for our um, stays all around the world to understand our music better. Mm -hmm. And not only that, we we really wanted to show our Levanta, which mm -hmm. was our newest and mm -hmm. last um, side of Clay. Mm -hmm. And since that song's just very cool and calm and for it's very nice to hear, but we also wanted an energetic side for, for example, Double Knot mm. was much more, you know, loud, mm -hmm. clear, you know, turn up. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, we decided to do two songs for that. That's right. Yeah. Great. Who came up with the French angle? Like, where, is, where does that come from? La France. The, the clé? Yeah. Clé. Like, La France. Who, does anybody here speak French? Um, I, I learned a I'm bit of not French. French. Oh, I'm not gonna, no. <laughs> I feel like, did you learn some? Uh, it was compulsory for me to learn French for two years. I oh, think wow. Oh, really? High school. But then I, I forgot <laughs> everything. You know, like, I nearly forgot everything. I still know a little, but you can say I'm not, bonjour. not like a... You can bonjour. say bonjour. bonjour. Do you want me to speak? Yeah, yeah, say yeah. something. Let's go, let's go. Bonjour, je m'appelle Félix. Comment oh. ça va? With the deep voice. Oh, ça my God. Bien. My heart is melting. Look away from me. Yep. <laughs> sorry, sorry, Zach. Oh, my God. You're going to seduce everyone here in the room. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. I can't do that. I don't even, I don't even know what you said. Oh, well, I said, hi, my name is Felix. Nice to meet you. How are you? Mm. That's so cool. Wow. Wow. <laughs> French. It was beautiful. Yeah. I might Thank cry. <laughs> um, wow. You have a tour coming. Yep. District 9. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's going to unlock. Unlock tour. So you're unlocking yeah. the key. True. Yeah. It's all you're connected. Getting you're getting it. District. <laughs> yeah. What is the key? What does it mean? Is there a meaning to it? Or have you established a meaning? Oh, this goes so deep though. Oh. Um, <sighs> okay. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm going I'm to I'm I'm explain uh, not too much. But I'm explaining like the important parts. You know the clay series. Um, clay. Well, it goes key one, key two, and then the last one is just clay and um, Levanta. But um, if you think about the whole thing, we're all relying on that key. You know, trying to get to new places, and we're all relying everything on the key. But in the end, we realize that you know this isn't you know the, the this isn't the answer. You know, this key that we're all trying to focus on. The key could be anything. It could be, you know, um, a dream that we had. It could be someone. It could be, you know, um, a person, I think, or whatever. But, um, you know, we wanted to show out in our last album that, you know, it's sometimes, you know, that can actually blind you from the real answer. And maybe just letting go of that could show you something much more bigger. And that's one of the meanings that we wanted to put out there. I Whoa. understand that. Yeah. Yeah, because like you're so focused on this one thing that it's all you're seeing. Exactly. You know, when you release that focus, other yeah. stuff comes into focus. That's that's true. That's it. The bigger picture. The big picture. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Very cool. Picture. Yeah. <laughs> so, I I don't think I've ever um, described it so correctly yet. Like, because we like leaving stuff for our fans, but um, yeah, kind of. Wrapped up everything. Whoops. That was, no, 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 that was eloquent and wise. Thank you. No, no, no. Thank you. So you're going to take this series and you're going to bring it to life. Yep. And that's the stage show. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, um, well, it's not really based on, um, you know, what we wanted to say in that series. But um, with our concert, we do have a lot of, lot of different performances, um, songs from our um, last trilogy as well from this trilogy and um yeah it's like a whole package thing can you explain the series to me because i love it like i love this idea that like three or four different pieces mm -hmm. make up the entire story mm -hmm. and how it's kind of staggered and stuff mm -hmm. it, why is that the right way to tell the story of stray kids um well you know this whole adventure that you know we're going through we are still going through it's um, a story itself. So we thought that, you know, um, even in the I Am series and the Clay series, having it as a series itself is just that much meaningful to us because it's like a, you know, especially when you watch like 
um, a drama or a movie, um, especially when it's in a series, you try to get more fo- you get more focused into it, and it kind of feels like um, you know a moment where if I'm going through this while watching this, kind of feels like the same thing. Like if it, you know what I mean. Like yeah. I'm creating your own timeline, and um, I think for us. Because with those um, series and the albums, it's what we feel and what we want to talk about. Um, it's you know it's directly inside that album as well. So when we think about um, you know the the I Am series, for example, if we think about um, District Nine, all those memories that we had at District Nine would you know just come in. So it's it's kind of like a timeline thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's following your life. Yep, that's what it is. It's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. Astronaut is the most recent record. Uh, yeah. One well, of the recents. One says, of the recents. Yeah. Uh-huh. One of the recents. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Is there two? Well, when did Double Knot come out? Double Knot came out in uh, that October. album. Yes, as a single first, and then we put it into that album. Got it. Mm-hmm. Astronaut's a pretty cool record. Mm, Astronaut is. What do you, uh, can you connect the title with the lyrics and give me the story to it? Um. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you know, we all know what an astronaut is, and um, I think um, what we wanted to express through this song was we can. I, I don't know. For for me, the song is kind of just really bright, energetic, and it's really kind of cheeky as well. And um, I think you know, with the concept of ha- um, it being an astronaut, kind of we wanted to say you know whatever. Whatever it is, we're ready and we are going out for a new adventure. And that's just the whole thing, yeah. A new adventure? Mm-hmm. So does this song pick up where Key left off? Yes. Oh. Yes. Yes. <laughs> cool. <laughs> I feel like you're divulging more than you want to. Yeah. <laughs> See, he's good at doing that, isn't he? He, he brings it out yeah. from He does this for a reason. <laughs> You know how many times you've been requested to have you guys hang out with us? Oh, really? Oh, really? Yeah, a lot. Did not Your stays that. are out there. They are local. Yay. Shout out to Stay. Thank you. Stays are amazing. Yes. I have a question for you guys. Can you explain this SKZ player thing? It's like an online series. Uh, it's coming back, uh, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys are doing it again? Um, What is it? Coming yeah. soon. Coming soon. Coming soon. Coming soon. <laughs> Who knows? Yeah, well, we're going to be doing it. Um, it's, um, it's a platform for us where we can... Um, you know, like Zach was saying earlier, how do you show like what you guys want to show like personally? Um, yeah, it's a platform for us where we can express, you know, a side where what we maybe haven't shown our stays before. Um, our most recent um, SKZ player was Lino. He was um, he did like a dancing video, and yeah, it was really really cool. So there's gonna be more to come. So it's kind of like social okay. media. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm, it's on YouTube. It's mm-hmm. Where show entertainment. Mm-hmm. Do you have your own personal Instagrams or no? No, 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 yeah, no, no, yeah. We don't. We have only our team. YouTube, love you. <laughs> <laughs> so YouTube's your best friend. Yes, YouTube's everyone's best friend. Best friend. Best friend. Yeah. Best friend. I totally get it. Like, who do we like? What, like, what do you watch on YouTube? Like dinosaurs, aliens, <laughs> and aliens. something animation. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, he's on like a different level yeah. to us. Yeah, yeah. You're like Very conspiracy t- theories. <laughs> he likes everything. Mm. Mm. <laughs> you know, like <laughs> strange thing also. Yeah, the natural things. Yeah, natural yeah. things. Uh, he watches a lot of um like documentary Ghost. stuff. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like National Geographic. Yeah, yeah he's Got on it. that. Yeah, your brain is a sponge. Yeah, uh, <laughs> maybe you know Cheetah is so fast. The cheetah, cheetah is yeah. cheetah, cheetahs are fast. Really fast. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everybody knows that. Yeah. <laughs> the more you know. But, you, but you, YouTube reaffirmed that the cheetah is fast. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I mean, for everybody you know, else. Joe told me. Yeah. <laughs> Any final thoughts? Well, I want to know what makes you guys different from other K-pop groups. Like, what makes Stray Kids Stray oh. Kids? To even be, you know, um, to be able to call a K-pop group for us, it's a really big honor. Um, to be a part of the K-pop community. The K-pop culture, it's, re- it's a really big honor for us as well. Um, if there was anything that could, I guess, um, maybe just characterize us uh, compared to other groups would be, I think, you know, I think it's just Stray Kids itself. I think Stray Kids has its own kind of genre. Um, our music 
and um, you know uh, our, our music itself there's a lot of different types of styles but one thing if it all has something in common it's it's got a really ongoing never-ending energy mm-hmm. there's like a really big energy source to it um, luckily our fans they gain a lot of energy from that energy and um, we always try to give out that energy as well so I'd say maybe yeah and en- energy cool yeah yeah Solid answer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I was watching you guys on YouTube make your cute faces. There's like a name for that. Yeah, it's called egg yo. Ah, <laughs> right. Do you guys actually find each other cute? Yes. <laughs> Can <you> translate that. <laughs> How so could they knows? not? I find you guys. You're all adorable. Yeah, yeah but you find each other cute. <laughs> so cute Got of, of course, of course. No, <laughs> no. I mean, I mean, <laughs> everyone, everyone, no. Chang Bin's cute. Yeah, yeah we do. every he's everyone cute. thinks he's cute. He's cute. I don't know him. <laughs> <laughs> no, but um, everyone has a in a you know. Oh, how do I explain? It? Like, they, everyone has their own. Do you have your second own person? Do you like, have your own bias? Yeah. <laughs> bias. Oh, oh, bias. Do you have a bias wow. in your own group in the team? Yeah, my bias is I am. Oh. <laughs> no. Um, my bias is everyone. Yeah. Oh, 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 you, <laughs> you, he's really. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. Nah, we like everyone. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Everyone, everyone's just one mm-hmm. big, like brotherhood family. Yeah, but who's the cutest, Felix? Oh. All right, Felix, you decide. Ooh. <laughs> 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 he's just like, nah, nah. <laughs> um. Yeah, I think everyone. You know what? I have nothing to say because everyone's <laughs> cute in their own way. So mm-hmm. yeah. But if you had to pick, <laughs> if I had to pick, <laughs> yeah, if you had to pick, do you want to show me something cute? No chance. No, no, okay. no, no, no. Come on, let's go with the youngest. Let's go with the youngest. You know what? Oh, I'm what? Get, <laughs> what? Oh, there's Mangne. Yeah. All right, you know what? I'm gonna have to pick Iron. Oh yeah. Because he's I been am. showing a lot of cute he's faces. Young, yeah. <laughs> youngest, young blood. <laughs> Who knows? I could check. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Stray cool. kids, you. I appreciate the time and energy today. I appreciate you guys very much. Yeah, right. thank no, you. Thank you so, thank you so much. Thanks for inviting us. Well, my studio is always open, you guys. Oh, really? Yeah. We'll, yeah. Uh, we're coming uh, tomorrow. Yeah, whenever you want. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to sleep here today. <laughs> and you guys all still live together. Yeah. Yeah. We still do. In Korea. Yeah, we still do. Yep. Yep. What a life. <laughs> it's really right. fun. You guys are awesome. I appreciate the time and energy. Give it up for Shrek here. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, beautiful human. Thanks for watching our full interview, but I get it. Like, a full interview is a lot. So we got a clips channel. We don't expect you to watch the full thing anymore. So we just gave you the highlights. Please subscribe and uh, notifications and all that stuff. Okay, cool. I love you.